There's another way of trying to classify these lipidemias, and this is known as a uh, Fredrickson classification of these lipidemias. So uh, this Fredrickson classification of these lipidemias, uh, you could say this lipidemia, you could say lipid disorders, you could say lipoprotein disorder, all right? Anyone can actually go in. And it was derived by this scientist, that's a Donald Fredrickson, <coughs> In the year 1967 all right so you derive the way of trying to now classify different types of what this lipidemias we should be looking at so this lipidemia everybody knows what the dyslipidemia is simply when you have the deposition of all these fats in your blood vessels around the body and all that so the Fredrickson classification is a system used to categorize this lipidemias that's abnormal lipid levels in the body and is um, categorized into six main types based on the lipoprotein pattern. It was developed by Donald Fredrickson in 1967. So here are the six types. We have the type one, which is what? Hyperchylomicronemia. And from the name, you know that what? The elevated levels of chylomicrons, all right? But you're having normal levels of what? Low density lipoproteins and high density lipoproteins. All right, then we have the type two, but type two is divided into what? Type two A and B. So for the type two A is familiar hypercholesteremia, which is uh, there's elevated levels of uh, low density like proteins, but having normal triglycerides and normal high density lipoproteins, right? Then the type two B, this one is a combined hyperlipidemia. Where you're having elevated levels of what low density lipoproteins and elevated levels of triglycerides, right? Then the high density lipoproteins could be normal or elevated, right? Normal or low, sorry, normal or low, right? So this image right here kind of like simplifies or summarizes everything, okay? So if you want to just grab it at a look, you can check it out. Then moving forward, then type three. Is what is known as what this beta lipoproteinemia. This one you're having elevated levels of what very low density lipoproteins and also the elevated levels of intermediate density lipoproteins. But you're having normal levels of low density lipoproteins and normal levels of high density lipoproteins. Then type four is what hypertriglyceridemia. There's elevated triglycerides, but there's no more normal low density lipoproteins and normal high density lipoproteins then mixed one mixed hyperlipidemia is where you're having high levels of what chylomicrons and also very low density lipoproteins all of them are kind of like shooting up all right so i think guys that's it for the Fredrickson classification of what dyslipidemias see you guys pretty soon